For more than a year, our world saw the entry of a new way of life that has become our new normal. We've been masking up, sanitizing, washing our hands regularly, and adhering to social distancing and many other protocols to keep ourselves safe and our loved ones safe too. We've all been eager to get back to our daily routine, enjoy our time with our friends and our schoolmates, while also spending time at the parks and playgrounds. Our governments and medical experts say this is possible thanks to the efforts in the vaccinations. And now, some of the most developed and wealthy countries across the world believe no one is safe until we all are safe. And thanks to that, we have the new COVAX vaccination scheme. Many countries across the world have united and joined hands, starting what is now known as the new COVAX vaccination scheme. These wealthy and developed countries believe that no one is safe until everyone is safe. February this year, Ghana in West Africa became the first country in the world to be a recipient of the vaccination under the new COVAX vaccination scheme. Doses were delivered and hundreds of thousands of citizens in the country were vaccinated. They were immediately followed by the distribution of the doses to many other countries across the world. The COVAX vaccination scheme is a historical turning point and it is the largest ever vaccination efforts across the world. It seeks to reach many countries through the equitable distribution of the vaccines. It is not about who can be able to access it easily, but who needs it most. The COVAX vaccine scheme is an initiative also supported by the World Health Organization in partnership with the wealthy and developed countries where they seek to ensure the development, research and the distribution of the vaccines. This will also enable countries that are unable to access or afford for the vaccines receive and to save more lives. In order to ensure the vaccines reach far and wide across the globe and in every corner across the world, the COVAX vaccine scheme has been established. The target of the vaccines is 2 billion in more than 190 countries to ensure that this valuable vaccine is accessed in every corner of the world far and wide in order to safeguard more lives. The equitable access of the vaccine is one of the pillars and principles of the COVAX vaccine scheme. And with that, it means with many people protected and many lives safeguarded, it means we might be able to get back to our life before the pandemic with spectators getting back to the stadiums, students resuming their classes physically and our lives coming back to normal. And that is all about the COVAX vaccine scheme. My name is Abdinur Aden.